Hey, so welcome to the More Acro Show. If this is your first time, I'm More Acro. I've been doing daily videos from Morocco this past year during quarantine. And as an end of the year wrap up, we're going to do my most disliked videos. I even took some notes. I got some clips, so we're gonna check that out and stick around till the end. We'll have a special wrap up. So without further ado, let's begin. So to begin our list, Polosario and the price of the Anza Souk. This was a video that people just read the title and they got very upset without watching the video. They thought we were trying to get political, but we we're explaining the situation in the souk in which goods could not travel to the south of Mor Morocco, causing for cheaper prices here in Anza and Agadir. It's good. Eat the bed. Natural, Daldi, El Ben Daldi. Popular video nonetheless with 30,000 views and only 48 dislikes, but some serious comments that said either change the name of the video or get out of the country. And uh, yeah, just a lot of controversy in the comments. Now this one was controversial just for the title. I didn't really know what Rotini Lawami was and also people thought we were trying to imply that in Africa they didn't have washing machines. It was just the case at our apartment that we did not have a washing machine installed for a while. So we had some fun with the bathtub and making videos every day. Sometimes you gotta just show the everyday things. Our Russian so the Umbrella Man on June 1st later came out to be true that he was a white supremacist. This happens in July. And this video was early in a very sensitive time in the USA. So a lot of the comments here thought it was insensitive. But I was just doing my best to create some entertainment and awareness around the situation. Next on our list is Nia, a video we went blind into with the little knowledge of where this dress comes from. Reaction content is not really a thing we do on this channel so much, but some days we follow our commentators' suggestions, and this was a popular video. We even gained some subscribers, but uh, we actually got banned in some countries for this video. Again, daily vlogs can be exhausting, so we wind up with videos like this. Uh, things to note about this video is the incredibly awful camera angles here and there, but also the fact that these were haram. If you have anything haram on the channel will get disliked, including this video probably. Now we had the wonderful Shenti life for an interview. Some people don't like interviews, they want to see our daily life. Again, our daily life is more fun if we bring other people into it. So here some of the controversy was with a Moroccan woman marrying a French man. This was something that caused some disturbances in the comments. And here we had the hammam. The controversy was it being a touristic hammam where Andrea and I could both go in there. So the hammam got a little bit of uh, controversy in the comments as well. If you go back and see the comments sometimes, Things are deleted to keep everyone safe and happy. Now this one was the least popular, one of my favorite thumbnails, but a topic that is relevant to anyone that would like to travel to Morocco from a country in which drinking is common. So here we explored what the cost of some beer and wine would be at the local liquor store. And this was definitely our most disliked video of 2020. But I think it's an interesting one for anyone looking to travel to Morocco. I had a friend who did not know that you could get beer in Morocco. A tasty video, but one that, again, got a lot of dislikes. It's when I share an American recipe for cheese fries with bacon. I had a craving one day, I had a dream. I had some cheese fries with bacon, so I went out and made it happen the next day but people really were against eating of the pork meat. You like it? Mm-hmm. It's above expectations. But even more tasty than the cheese fries was the chicken bastilla. Now, sadly, the background contained a lot of foul language. There's a gathering that evening, 
So we had to take the video down. Hopefully one day we'll find an edited version of it so we could all get really hungry watching this Bastia. So good. So putting that video together is way more work than I expected it to be. But I promised you a special message at the end. And if you made it to this point, you are special. Special on this channel for sticking with us through points that shook a lot of subscribers off. A lot of people quit the channel or left either in the comments or silently as well. So if you made it through all those videos, you made it through this compilation, very special, thank you. We wanted to just revisit some of our old videos today. We work with uh, limited technology here, so I'd go back and download those videos off YouTube to get the clips. So it became a little bit of a project here. But thank you again for making it to this point. What would you like to see in the future? We're thinking about a best of moments, a Tajin compilation. Uh, we're just sticking at home these days, so we didn't really have a chance to get out of the house and make the action happen. But here we are. Thank you again for watching it to this point. But what's most shocking to me was how difficult it was to find these videos with so many dislikes. It's amazing how positive this community is. Most of the videos have less than 10% uh, dislikes in proportion to likes, many with less than five. So really thank you all for the support. If you're watching at this point, I suggest you drop a like and we're looking forward to the new year 2021 where we want to expand this channel get out of our usual routine here and bring some things that the viewers would really like to see I know a lot of viewers are around the world and they want to see different cities in Morocco so we'd really really wish to bring that to you in the coming year now we'll see what the coming year 2021 has to hold more controversy, more peace. At least with each video, I learn some lessons. I get to know the audience a little bit better, get to know the culture. So we live and we learn. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. This is always uh, a great lesson to be had. And failure, not all these videos are failure, but lessons are always learned and we keep on going so don't be afraid to make mistakes <laughs> so when you fall off that horse remember to dust yourself off and try again do not be afraid and wishing you all the best in this coming year okay, say something for the end of the video uh, what no stop oh, i'm not ready yet happy new year